Reggie, they talk in a short series, or I guess any time in a baseball game, experience. Do you feel the A's experience is going to be a big factor in this? Well, Tony, there's no question about it. I know the, you know, facts are facts. The sky's blue and the sun's shining. Uh, I know that uh, when I first went into the playoff series, I was wondering what it would be like and denied this and denied that. But the fact that you get there, you do have to acclimate yourself. And uh, there are teams that are young players that have never been in, in a playoff series and, and teams like the Red Sox and a guy like Freddie Lynn. But then again, you know, a guy like Freddie Lynn is probably the most valuable player and definitely has acclimated and, and has made the changes uh, to the pressure of a major league season. And I don't see where he's not going to have any problem here adapting to this pressure playoff series the same way. Okay, Freddie, how much sleep did you get last night? Tony, I slept pretty well to about 1.30 in the morning when our fire alarm system <laughs> went off. And it was, went ringing for about 15 minutes. And after that, I started thinking about the game a little bit. And uh, I didn't get too much sleep after that. The fire alarm, did you send somebody over to wake him up last night? No, Tony, and uh, as a matter of fact, I went to bed last night after reading my scouting report and sitting around the room at about 10.30, and uh, I woke up this morning about 3, bright-eyed and bushy-tailed, and I finally went back to sleep, but at 5 minutes of 7, I was up and couldn't do anything else but get up. Freddie, I just want to have Reggie very quickly tell you what their theme song was. I heard it in the uh, I heard it in the locker room a while ago. What is it? <laughs> it's called "For the Love of Money" by oh, the OJs. <laughs> that's why you win so much, Freddie Lynn and Reggie Jackson. Thanks so much. Back up to Kurt.